The Bible says to everything there is a season. MDPC has enjoyed many seasons in its history. Ten years ago, many of you will remember that we were in a season of construction where we were building a ministry center and a church life center, which included a gymnasium and designated spaces for children and youth. But now 10 years have gone by, and just like with a home, it seemed right for us to consider a remodel because we want very much for MDPC to be a home away from home for our children and youth. Now, this home that we have remodeled is no ordinary house, and when you see it, you'll know exactly what I'm talking about. It represents creation, the galaxy, everything from those little treasures you find in the backyard all the way out to the Milky Way. Each of the 16 classrooms has a theme, and those themes are about the fruits of the Spirit. We want our children to understand what uh, those things are as God works in their lives. And then the large group gathering space we call the launch pad. And when you go there, you'll certainly understand why. It's a place designed to launch the mind and the heart and the spirit of children into worship and celebration and relationships. Now, it's taken several years for all of this to come into being. It started as a con conversation a couple of years ago. But it wasn't until Gretchen Razor, by her generosity, made a large gift from her estate available to Memorial Drive Presbyterian Church. The elders considered uses for this money and determined a couple of years ago to make significant improvements in the chapel. And then this past year made a decision that we would concentrate on also upgrading our facilities for children and youth. The project in the children's area started about five months ago. It began with uh, painting of murals and reconstruction of walls. And we are here today to dedicate and to give thanks to, in a sense, launch this space for the glory of God. Because Jesus said, let the children come to me and don't stop them because theirs is the kingdom of heaven.